The UK fishing industry at the moment is on the up, I think. Um, we've been through some hard times with quotas and things like that, but I think we've really turned a corner. Our fish and shellfish industry is supplying to global markets effectively, and what we need to do is position our guys um, in the same place as other countries like Holland and Ireland who have benchmarking schemes for their fleets. So we want to make sure that our guys can compete in that marketplace when the buyers are looking for quality, looking for safety and provenance. The Responsible Fishing Scheme is a good tool for sharing best practice amongst different fisheries and different fishermen up and down the length and breadth of the country. Over the last few years, uh, sustainability and uh, catch quality has just become more and more important to the restaurants, well, to everyone in general. The Responsible Fishing Scheme is an independently audited assessment of a vessel's behaviours in terms of fishing practices, crew competencies, environmental consideration. It's a measure of how good the quality is, it's a measure of how good the practices are, and we need to be in that sort of game to be able to compete with the rest of the world. Obviously quality is of huge importance. Uh, we're looking at um, the vessels themselves as platforms for handling food. We're looking at the environmental considerations, making sure that the vessels um, behave in the most environmentally friendly manner possible, and also crew competencies to make sure they're safe themselves and they're capable of sort of looking after the product and, and their fellow crewmen. The scheme's a good tool for making sure that everybody on the vessel knows exactly what their place is what's required of them when looking after the catch. We have a systematic procedure for cleaning down the boat each trip, focusing on the conveyor belt, the fish handling area and processing area and the fish room where the fish are kept. The audit process is at the heart of the scheme. It's a two-stage process. First of all, we work the boats and coach them on a one-to-one -one basis at their own speed. Um, when they're ready, we then send them on to an independent third-party auditor who takes them all through all the scheme requirements. Um, hopefully, if they've done well in the coaching, they should pass the audit with flying colours. The audit process was very, very painless. The auditor came aboard and he was very, very helpful. He was offering suggestions as to how we might implement any small changes that you were requiring. Consumers of fish and shellfish these days are very savvy. They're looking for quality, they're looking for provenance, they're looking for environmental awareness of the vessels that they're catching their product. This third party assessment of vessels entering the scheme is a very good way of doing that. The cost is minimal of uh, joining the responsible fishing scheme and for me there's so many benefits with that. It's getting more and more fishermen together who are acting responsible to you know, look after the environment, look after our fish stocks for the future. The scheme is open to any UK registered fishing vessel, right from the very smallest one to a single-handed to the big pelagic vessels at the other end of the scale. It's a way for them to demonstrate they're landing a quality product, they're proud and passionate about what they do, and it puts them in a good place in terms of being competitive in the marketplace. Um, you know, it, it's good for the industry, it's good for everybody all round. Being part of the scheme has um, really energised me in the way now that we look at different aspects of everything and the way we, with the environment, the, uh, the way we keep the fish. So yeah, it's, 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 it's helped me in a load of ways, like, you know. I've got two young sons that are coming along and they're keen about fishing and fishing's in their blood. And we have to look after the environment and uh, fish responsibly and hopefully our future, future generations coming along will be able to carry on the same. Everybody's constantly looking for standards to be raised. I can see the scheme being the perfect tool for that job. For skippers who aren't involved in the Responsible Fish Scheme, I would say, you know, take a good look at it. And, uh, you know, it's benefited me in lots of ways. And, like, I, you know, I, I, th I think we should all get together on this and, you know, let's get on board and do it, you know. For anybody who's not part of the scheme, a little bit sceptical at the moment, I say have a chat with us, give us a shout, have a look on the website for contact details. We'll talk you through what the scheme is about. There's nothing to be frightened of. If you're doing a good job now, landing a quality product and passionate about what you do, you're the sort of boat we want.